Hello everyone and welcome back to Hot Ticket. I'm Kevin Hornsby for Cox 11 and it's time again to start the golf tournaments for good causes and Miller Oil Foundation is here to talk about that. Lindsay Pryor is with us as well as Jennifer Palestrant from the Art Center. Thank you for being here. Let's talk a little bit about this golf tournament. When's it going to be? Um, so the golf tournament this year is Tuesday, June 3rd um, at the Bayville Golf Club in Virginia Beach. Um, and we are really excited about that. Um, we expect anywhere between 130 and 140 golfers. So nice. It's a great afternoon. We have food, we have on course um, entertainment, we have putting contest, we've got you know, lunch and dinner and cash prizes and all kinds of great stuff. And in addition to the golf tournament, we have a, the night before. Mm -hmm. Tell us about that. We have our chairman's receptions, our annual party. Uh, this year it's on Monday, June 2nd, the mm -hmm. evening of Monday, June 2nd. And um, it's just a celebration to get everybody together. And we always include um, a charity partner for that event. And this year it is the DART Center. Let's talk about the Art Center. What do you guys do? We are, uh, the DART Center is a living arts center. It's in downtown Norfolk, right by Waterside and the Marriott. And it is home to 32 working artists who are there every day of the week um, in their studios creating um, art, whether it's glass, it's painting, it's ceramic, um, it's mixed media, needle felting, and it's open to the public. So we love for people to come down and take a tour, wander around, visit with the artists, purchase items. Mm -hmm. um, and then we also have a very large art school as well, both for um, in-house, for teaching, and then we do a lot of community outreach. Yeah, and let's talk about what you're doing with the foundation. Oh, we're excited to be partnering with Miller Oil this year for the foundation. Um, so we've got the silent auction for mm -hmm. the chairman's reception. We'll have some great things. I've got some beautiful paintings, some beautiful uh, jewelry that we're going to be doing, some great uh, event baskets, yeah. um, a great dinner from Footer's Barbecue, and all mm. kinds of really fun things. And Lindsay, let's talk about the foundation itself. Why do you guys, your company, you're you know in it to make money, but you're also giving back. Why is that important to you guys? Well, the Miller Oil Foundation is actually kind of a nonprofit um, arm of Miller Oil Company. So um, it was started by uh, Gus and Deanne Miller, mm -hmm. um, just as an opportunity to give back to the community that's really helped to make Miller Oil Company successful. Yeah. And so, you know, Miller Oil Company just celebrated their 36th year in business. Nice. Um, and the foundation, we are in our 11th year. So it's just an opportunity to make sure we're saying thank you and giving back to the people who've been so generous with, with us. Okay. And the Art Center saw this opportunity to get on board here. What made you guys want to do that? Well, Miller Oil has been a big supporter of the Art Center for many, many years. And so we've, we've all worked together for quite a long time. And um, as a uh, longtime multi-generational avid golfer, um, mm. any chance that, you know, we can get out to uh, go and have a good time on, on, the, on the golf course is a good thing. Well, I think half the crew shooting this today wants to do this as well. <laughs> let's talk about the host, the Bayville. Let's talk about that a little bit. Mm -hmm. How great a venue is that for this So tournament? beautiful. They always take such great care of us. Mm -hmm. um, um, just, you know, one of the most renowned golf courses definitely in the area and in the state. Um, and it's beautiful. It's a beautiful day. Rain or shine, it's always a beautiful day there. <laughs> so when you have people wanting to come out and golf, how do they get in mm -hmm. touch? Got so they can go to MillerOilFoundation.org mm -hmm. and they can actually download all the registration materials right on our website. Um, they can get in touch with us with any questions as well and um, they can RSVP to the party or the golf or both. I would vote for both. Yeah. Now, you mentioned on-course entertainment. Mm -hmm. What is that about? <laughs> well, we have um, we have a great putting contest that's been a lot of fun. Uh -huh. We've done the last couple of years where somebody walks away a cash prize winner for that. Very good. And um, this year we're going to be introducing a cornhole game on the course to pass a little bit of the time. And then, of course, we have um, VIP beverage carts that are on call for our premium sponsors. So anytime you need anything, you just call your cart and they'll come running. Uh, and then we have beverage carts that just kind of roam the whole time anyways. Snacks, beer, soda, water, whatever you need. We make sure everyone so is feeling appreciated. So it's fun in the sun, but for a good cause. Absolutely, absolutely. We were um, honored to be able to give back to six fabulous nonprofits um, nice. in the Hampton Roads area. Just this last year, mm -hmm. um, we give out um, about you know, five to six grants every year. Well, so. I want to thank you for doing that and 
creating a fun way to do it. Thank you both for being here. Thank you for having us. Thank and you. you can come on out and golf for a great cause or just come to the reception and party. You visit the website for information. For Hot Ticket, I'm Kevin Hornsby.